Mazer. Yeah. Mazer from where? Dublin. Dublin. And what are you doing in Westport? <laughs> <laughs> what am I doing? Good question, yeah, yeah. I know. Um, I got invited down with Westport Arts Festival. The guys got on to me um, a few months ago. They were interested in me uh, being a part of the um, part of the event. So um, that's why I'm here, yeah. They invited me down to make the hero. This is a big project. It sure is, yeah. yeah. That's a it's pain. substantially big. So yeah, when I got invited and I was like showing me the canvas, uh, they sent me pictures, it was a little bit hard to scale, so we, we, we only actually saw the full size till I got down, so it was a little bit bigger than anticipated. But um, it's fine, it's it's not my first. You got a bit of help? One. Yeah, yeah, we go. that's a part of the sort of projects that I do as well. It's I'll, um, I'll try and get the community involved as well, because sort of sharing ownership of uh, of the work. And how did all this start? Yeah, how, did you, how did you get into it? Yeah. I started working my my artistic career probably started when I was fifteen. Um, that was just in Dublin, going around painting and started getting painted murals and ended up studying uh, fine art for a little bit and then studied visual communications, which is graphic design. And I sort of put that together with what I do now, with what I did on the streets, and it's led to this. And did you ever write on a wall before well, you were was. before you were invited to? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we might have seen your work around the place in Dublin here or there, wherever you want to. But there's some of them fantastic, and some cities are fantastic. The, the graffiti stuff is great. Yeah, it is. You know, it's uh, getting it's getting really progressive now, and there's acceptance to it, and public art, and um, with that acceptance, there's a lot more allowance and to do bigger projects like this, not such quick uh, installations. And um, so, yeah, it's like this post street art movement. I, I don't know how to categorize it, but it's. Um, it's definitely merging with, with the art world a lot more now, so it's, it's yeah. exciting. What do you mean you've been accepted? Well, I don't need <laughs> it. I don't want... But uh, I guess there is a, a mutual acceptance. We, we accept them too, you know. Are there many people at this now? Yeah, this will be the biggest art movement in the world, for sure. Um, yeah. In Ireland, are there many at it? In, in Ireland, yeah, yeah, yeah. Collectively, there's a lot of... In Dublin, there is. Uh, across Ireland, Galway, Cork, Limerick. I know a lot of artists up in Belfast. Yeah, 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 it's great. And who came up with the design? I did. Yourself, yeah? Yeah. yeah they, they call you in and you yeah, give you a free yeah, hand. You get a free hand, yeah. Yeah, I just... Um, it's sort of based on a lot of the work I do already and I'm just continuing that narrative, really, you know, so... Um, it's, it's part of a big body of work, really. Is there a living in this? I don't want to know what you're hearing, but there is yeah, a living in yeah, it. There, there is. is. Yeah, it kept going all the time, like, yeah. I'm lucky enough to just be in a position there where I can do, a, do what I love to do and mm. choose projects and... Um, Maybe the biggest benefit of it is that I get to travel all the time. You know, okay. to get to leave the mark and be in Westport. And only a week and a half ago, I was in Israel and actually coming back to the States. Um, so for that, yeah, like um, it's very rewarding. You know, this was a convent one time, yeah. I do. And what would you think the nuns would think of this? Uh, it's <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> we'll have to ask them. We'll have to ask them. Yeah.